I'm Table has been set up to take out the old terminal at Bradley International Airport. That's right, Terminal B or the Murphy Terminal has been vacant for almost four years now. It was opened back in 1952 but couldn't handle the increased traffic, so it was closed in 2010. Chief Capital Correspondent Mark Davis joins us live tonight with more on what comes next up in Bradley. Mark. Uh, hi, Keith and Ann. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. Yeah, it's going to cost about $20 million, and it's now scheduled to finally begin in August. The building will actually have to be deconstructed over a period of about 12 to 18 months. That's because asbestos and other building materials from the 1950s will have to be carefully removed. You can't just tear it down or implode it. Eventually, this space will be used to make getting into and out of the airport faster. That's going to make way for a future transportation center here at the airport. A uh, transportation center that's going to house all of our rental car facilities that today are scattered in and around the airport. Now that uh, transportation facility should be up and running sometime in 2016. The new terminal was completed, uh, completed here in, uh, and opened in 1986 and is expected to be adequate for expected growth at the airport for at least another decade. Now when the new transportation center is completed, uh, it's also going to have some additional parking and is going to have some sort of bus service to go back and forth to that uh, Hartford or New Haven, Hartford, Springfield line that is expected to be up and running by 2016. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.